Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Astha Dayal and I'm a consultant gynecologist with CK Birla Hospital in Gurgaon. Today we're going to talk about the different vaccines we need in pregnancy. So the Government of India guidelines uh, tell us that we need two doses of uh, tetanus toxoid leni in pregnancy which is uh, at a, dis a difference of one month. So the first dose you should take between the 4th and 5th month which is after the 16th week and the second dose comes one month after that. Uh, this is actually a part of the national immunization program. But if we follow the worldwide guidelines, then instead of the second tetanus, we prefer giving the Tdap vaccine. Now this Tdap vaccine actually includes tetanus, diphtheria and whooping cough or pertussis. This is actually the same vaccine which we give to our children when they are born. Now if the mother receives this vaccine in the third trimester, that means between the 27th to the 34th week or the 36th week, then it gives protection to the baby. And we also feel that this vaccine, because the mother has the child's infection, hoti hai, so the baby gets protected from this infection of whooping cough. So nowadays we give the first dose of tetanus and then one month later in the third trimester, we prefer giving the Tdap vaccine. Iske alawa, there is another vaccine that we give pregnant ladies because we are vulnerable. So, the vulnerable group who catch more infections quickly, we prefer the flu vaccine. Dena. So, all the small children, people of old age group, people who have some other medical problems and like them also women with pregnancy should be given this vaccine after their first trimester and we generally can give it any time during their uh, second or the third trimester according to the country and the local uh, guidelines. Now uh, the third vaccine that we generally give is the so if a woman is Rh negative that means unka blood group agar negative hai and their husband is positive then we give an extra vaccine to these women between the 28th to the 34th week and that is called the anti-D vaccine. Uh, is say we prevent any antibody formation in the mother. Also, if once they are delivered and their baby turns out to be having a positive blood group, then again we give this vaccine within 72 hours of delivery. Also, during their pregnancy, if they have any episode of bleeding, again they receive a dose of the anti-D vaccine. So, these are the vaccines that we generally give in pregnancy. Uh, if you have any further questions, you could contact me uh, by calling up the CK Birla Hospital for an appointment. Thank you.